hey guys welcome to my channel um our kitchen is being renovated so it's a bit of a mess but we're we're i think a solid 80 percent done that is actually one of the reasons why i'm also a bit late with videos the bottom birdie my cockatiel is blossom if you're new here uh the uh that one's muffin on top of the toy and then we have edward over here and kiwi just right over there um so i just wanted to show you guys my cage someone's gonna definitely ask me if muffin moved in no she or he is not um we don't know the gender yet so anyway um muffin just spends some time um and then you know i put her back to her weaning cage and then yeah we we'll just start right enough rambling so i'm just going to show you guys the toy one by one uh blossom might be out of frame i don't know what the hell muffin is doing um but blossom most likely when i open the cage you're not going to see her she's just going to end up coming out so yeah let's begin so i'm sure you guys have seen my other cage videos but if you haven't this is how we open it yes hello want to say hi to your friends okay i'm sure you want to go on my shoulder okay. so as i showed you guys earlier this is the front and then i'll just show you guys the toys um i don't think i'll show the perch because i don't really change uh, my birth perches a lot um it's only every few m months actually um i find that works best for me personally um that's that's just a mess that I prefer. But the toys, I change it weekly. But I thought maybe late summer, mid summer, I don't know where everyone lives, but it can, it'd be late summer for us right now. We're getting into fall. Um, so I wanted to show you guys what I have in my cage. So let's begin. Okay, this might be a bit hard to see, and I'm sure that's gonna be the case with most of the toys in here. But this is a swing I have. I think I got this from PetSmart. Um, I'll probably have all the toys links down below. Most of the toys came from Feathered Addictions. Um, this one though is from PetSmart. This toy I got from Lisa. It was kind of like a gift swap thing that we did. So Muffin's enjoying uh, the toy clearly. This is also another toy I got from Lisa. Thank you very much, Shalisa. Um, it's also from Feathered Addictions. This is also another toy I have. Um, it has a strawberry in the center. Um, it's a really nice toy. I really like the strawberry and the yellow. It really has a very nice contrast. This is also a toy I have um it was a gift from lisa from the box that i have um it's also from feathered addiction um and then yeah let's continue i had this toy for some time um uh, this toy where was it from it i think it's from petsmart i i could be wrong but this toy i think should be from petsmart um it wasn't expensive or anything so yeah, my birds really like this. I often use this. I've had it for quite a long time, but my birds actually really like it. So I don't throw it away and you know, it kind of looks used quite a bit, but they like it. And I guess that's all that matters. I have this toy too. Um, again, this is also from Feathered Addictions. It spins um, when they put their beaks on that small hoops they look triangular and then they could roll it and there's small beads at the bottom and they play with that as well i have two toys over here i really like these toys um one of them was from pet value which is the guitar um i don't know if you guys have pet value but i think it's a common toy you could probably find it from PetSmart as well the toy on uh, the toy with the heart that is from also feathered addictions i have a lot of toys from feathered addictions and um things for wings but my things for wings toys uh, my birds destroyed it so it's not anymore with us this is another toy it's kind of like a star um i actually don't really put toys close to the food dish but because i have muffin here and muffins is, um a relatively new bird to the cage i just have toys at the bottom just in case something goes wrong muffin if she ends up being at the bottom of the cage uh, she'll have something to play with so that's a toy i have 
that I had. So this is another toy that I have. I'm not gonna lie, it has a mirror and I'm sure you guys could see it. It's not a favorite of my birds, believe it or not, but I still have it in the cage, you know, just in case at the bottom of Muffin ends up coming down for whatever reason, that she'll have something to play with over here as well. So the way I am holding my camera, just so you guys could see the toy, it's pretty ridiculous. So I have my finger over here, if you couldn't tell, so you guys could get a better angle. Um, this is a, a toy I really, really like. It's very unique. It's um, a bumblebee. Yes, hello, Muffin. What are you doing? Thank you very much. You could come here. You want to come? Yes? No? Step up. Step up. You got to step up. Okay, there we go. Muffin's such a little cutie. Okay, okay so uh, Muffin's in frame now. Um, sh where are you going? Okay, so and then I'm going to show you guys Edward and uh, Kiwi, which I know the frame is kind of blurry, but I'm dealing with four birds over here, so I mean, it's a bit difficult. Here is Kiwi and Edward. Um, they're doing perfectly fine, guys. Um, they're both due for a vet appointment. Um, my vet already emailed me saying, hey, they're kind of due for the six month appointment. So I'll probably have another video coming up of me taking them to their vet. Um, and then obviously I have to take Muffin for the DNA test and then Blossom for just a regular checkup too. So those videos will come. Um, but yeah, they're doing fine. Okay, so it's quite hard for me to film the birds. I know you guys really want to see them. That's because Blossom's on my head. I mean, she's really not having it. Anyway, um, yeah, so this is a very cute cool of my little Edward. Edward's doing perfectly fine. Edward has never been a fan of video. Okay, there we go. Edward has never been a fan of the camera or anything. And then we have Kiwi in frame. I don't even know if this is in focus. We have Kiwi in frame. Kiwi doesn't mind the camera. Edward doesn't really like it. Um, they both step up, but I'm really not going to end up taking them out of the cage. Um, it's just going to be too chaotic. Right, guys? I keep telling people that you don't want to be on camera and you just want scratches. Right? Often they're like, what are they doing? Oh, Blossom, such a cutie. Right, Blossom? I love you. I love you. Muffin, I love you too. Where's my little guys? I love you guys too. I mean, the, my video footage is very blurry, but like, whatever. Da-dum. Da-dum. Da-dum, 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 da-da-da-dum. <laughs> Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so annoying. Let's see if Muffet's gonna like it. Blossom's like, mm, not so much. I'm so annoying. Are you hungry? Okay, I'll give you your formula. Okay, here, now we're gonna have a, s a screaming bird. <laughs> Oh, they're so cute. I think they'll be very good friends. Right? Hopefully. Also, a question a lot of you guys have is, uh, how is a Blossom and Muffin getting along? If you can't separate the two, that one's Blossom. That one's Muffin. The difference is... Oh, oh, catch on. Okay. Okay, well, okay, that was a close call. Muffin, come here, let me, okay, let me help Muffin up, guys. Oh, there we go. Okay, so the difference is, someone asked me, Blossom has grays, uh, Muffin doesn't have any grays. Um, also, Muffin has red eyes, Blossom has, they're pretty dark, I would say black. Um, so you can see the feathers, they're gray in color, Muffin doesn't have any grays. Um, I don't know anything else, I mean, other than that, they look quite similar, but that's the main difference. I mean, their eye color and then kind of the colors on their feathers. Um, so, yeah. Blossom. Oh, look at my cutie pie. Now, I will be very honest. 
They're quite clingy, both of them. Um, and... Yes? Yes, Muffin? Is there something you would like to say? No? Is there something you would like to say? Okay, maybe? Okay, and now, don't poop on camera. Are you gonna poop? Okay, um, oh no, no poops. Okay, so I think this is the end of the video. I've had a good... Okay, my birds are just being weird. Okay, so this is the end of the video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. The little guys are in there. They're actually quite harder to catch, believe it or not. Um, because these guys, they're not... They, they're good at flying, but uh, Kiwi and Edward, they're really fast. So, um, anyway, this is the end. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Um, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Bye-bye.